All the way back to the United States, Dr. Susan Michael, USA Director of the International Christian Embassy, Jerusalem. Hi, Susan. Hi, I'm Dr. Susan Michael, the President of the United States Branch of the International Christian Embassy, Jerusalem. And it is our honor and our privilege to be a partner with CAM in this global work of monitoring and combating anti-Semitism. Our organization is headquartered in Jerusalem, where we were founded in 1980. We function as a representative body for Christians all around the world, providing a connection for them with Israel. We, uh, from day one, our mission statement has been out of Isaiah 40, verse one, which says, comfort ye, comfort ye, my people, says the Lord. And we were very aware that after some 2000 years of really bad relations between Jews and Christians, that we were part of starting of a whole new season, a whole new relationship based on mutual respect. And so our task has been to demonstrate Christian support for Israel in very practical ways, which means that we have been there doing humanitarian aid. We uh, sponsored the largest home for Holocaust survivors in Israel. We have been placing well over 200, probably 250 bomb shelters by now across Southern Israel and now in the Northern part of Israel just practical ways of demonstrating Christian support for Israel. Because we are the largest Christian Zionist organization in the world, we reach into over 170 countries, and we have some form of representation or even a branch office in over 90 countries of the world. We have had tremendous influence in building educational programs for the local Christian community in our nation. For that, for me, that means here in the United States. But third on our list of priorities is to take a stand in the public square for Israel when needed. And I'm shocked to say that even here in the United States, that public stand is more and more, not just in support of Israel, but against rising anti-Semitism. You know, Anti-Semitism is based on a false narrative of lies and hatred spread about the Jewish people and about the state of Israel. As Christians, we are very committed to the truth. We believe the Bible is truth, but also historical fact. We need to arm our community with the facts to be able to articulate a better defense of Israel. And so our organization is committed to that, to educating the Christians around the world with the truth about Israel, the truth about the Jewish people, and mobilizing the Christian community to stand on that truth. We cannot allow anti-Semitism to continue to rise. It has had wreaked havoc over the last year since October the 7th and we need to rise up against it. Anti-Semitism lives in the far le radical left and in the far radical right. Our community is in the mainstream. We are in the middle. And so we need to arm that community to push back against the left and against the right and to be able to articulate a defense of Israel and the Jewish people. This is what we're committed to, what we are doing, and what we're going to be doing even more in 2025. So we link arms with all you organizations around the world standing against this evil and standing in support of Israel and the Jewish people. Thank you.